Welcome back to my channel. It's Teresa and today's video I have a Jeffree Star Lip Ammunition Single Lipstick Review for you guys. So for today's video I have the lovely shade Jawbreaker and I'm so excited to try and put it on my mouth. But first let's get the details of this beautiful lipstick. So this is vegan cruelty free retails for 18 US dollars. And as part of the Jawbreaker collection I know I know I'm late to the game but they did have a sale and I got them for cheap and now I finally have them so I'm super duper excited. On the sides, it says, Extreme Pigment, Creme Brulee Infused, Highly Addicting, Cruelty Free, and Vegan. So this is the packaging here, and then the Jawbreaker logo there. Alrighty, let's open her up. Da -da -da -da. Oh my god, that's what they look like there. They're so freaking cute. I love the packaging of the lip ammos. I think that they're so different looking and just so pretty, and I just love this chartreuse green. It is so freaking stunning. So let's open her up. Da -da -da. Oh my god, look at this. So this is absolutely freaking stunning. This is the Jewel Breaker shade here. And oh my god, I'm freaking obsessed. Look at that. So this would make a beautiful topper. It's not like a super, super, like, you know, one color kind of vibe. But it would be a beautiful, beautiful topper on a liquid lip. It would be stunning. Stunning. I'm so freaking excited. So I'm here to try it on my mouth and see what it looks like. So this is shade Jawbreaker by Jeffree Star. Oh, look at that shift. It's so stunning. Oh, and it just smells so good as well. I think with this eye look, this lip is quite nice. It's nice and understated. It's just a nice reflect going on and off the mouth. Do you see what I mean? Like it's not super super intense, but I do want to see what it looks like on top of like a nude natural like lip, just to kind of get the vibe. But that is it by itself. Still breaker. I've also just wiped it off, and you legit could not tell that I wiped it off. It's so glittery. So it, even if you had this on while you were eating, and then it wiped off, it still leaves like a nice glittery residue as well. Which is just real pretty on its own. Alright, so I've just put a nude on my lips as well. As well as on my hands. You can tell the difference on my hand. So I'm going to go hand first. So it looks like a, with a nude topper on top. And that's what it looks like there. So I've just kind of topped it nicely with the blue shift. But given it's like substance underneath. So I'm hoping that's what it does on my mouth. So let's pop it on. And that is it on there. I feel like with the nude, it kind of makes it a bit more subtle. Do you kind of get my vibe? I don't know. It's kind of made it look a bit more grey as well, just with a normal warm base nude underneath, which is quite weird. I'm just going to turn on the flashlight here. And show you guys. So you can see the glittery parts. I don't know. I really, really like it. Um, For the lipstick itself, like putting it on, it's a very hydrating formula. Like it's nice. I don't know. This is... It's weird for me doing that too. It comes up, like, look at that. Like, you could use that as a highlighter if you wanted a cream-based highlighter or something. Like, of course, it's a very, very strange color, but the actual quality of lipstick itself, it goes on really nicely. It's blue. If you had deep freeze, it would be a good comparison to that. If you love the deep freeze um, skin frost, then you will be obsessed with this. It's just really pretty. I think with my eye look, the blue definitely goes with really well. Um, and, yeah, just on top of the blue, it's just... A nice kind of icy look if you're going for like a cool tone look this is perfect I think and yeah I think it would be a really really nice highlightery shade especially if you like deep freeze I think that this color is definitely one that you'll be freaking obsessed with so what do I think about the jawbreaker lip ammunition I think it's really cute I think it's really um like versatile in the ways that you can use it you could even use it as an eyeshadow like putting it on here and smudging it around like, you can see how it spreads, but also how much the glitter actually lingers. Like, look at that. If you rub that in as a body highlight or something, you could use it as many things. And all of the lipsticks are eye safe as well. Like, I just think that that's really cool. And just the effects of those two there, it's just super, super pretty. So what do you guys think about the Jeffree Star lip shade in shade Jawbreaker? Let me know in the comments down below. But until next time, you'll have to wait to see what the other ones to see what you think. But until next time, I love you so much, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.